Hello YouTube, this is MC Unleashed, and today we're bringing you a tutorial on how to make texture packs uh, on Minecraft 1.5 or 1.5.1. They updated, updated it and changed it quite a bit. So, here's just a tutorial on how to make it. I make a new texture pack if you want to. The things you'll need for this are WinRAR, the 32-bit version. Because with a 32-bit version, after the trial's up, you can continue to use it. When you just hit close, you'll see that later in the video. And that's all you need. There are some other programs for editing the texture packs that I would like to suggest, like paint.net. But the paint that you already have on here will be sufficient. So what you do is you open up your search and you search for run. You open up run and you go to app percent app data percent. This is easy to find if you just go to browse and you go to your files. It should be up here. Of course, you have to have the property set for show hidden files, which is easy to do. So anyways, you just open this up and go to Minecraft. And here are texture packs. This is where you'll put your texture packs when you put your texture pack after you make it, which will just make the, fo the folder right now. You open it up, it's called folder, and name it texture, whatever you want to name it. And now you go to your Minecraft jar, which you can find in your bin, right there, and it should, should just be named Minecraft. Now you can exit out of that. And here you go, here's the 40 day trial period is over, but you can just hit close and you can continue to use it, because that's how awesome they are. You don't need to delete MetaInf if you have it, but you can if you want to. It's it's not necessary to run Minecraft. It just interferes with mods if you have any. I don't have any mods right now. And what you do is you organize your files by, you know, the type. So all your class files are on the bottom while you have your PNG and text documents. And what you do is you copy all of them or you know, just drag them into your texture folder. Oops, don't want the class files. There you go. Now the folder's created. And if you want to edit the textures for certain things, th this is where it's different. It used to be a, P a PNG file right here that would say terrain. And you could edit all the things that would all be side by side. But now it's in here, textures. You can edit the item one. Here, let's organize this differently, like that. You can or you can change the item ones, which is, you know, anything that's not a block. You can change how they look. Or you can go to blocks and change these. Change how it's organized as well. And names for all of them. And I'm going to go change all, I'm going to go change the wool, the wool, the, just the normal wool and make it clear where is wool yeah not ah, it's cloth now so we do is open up cloth with whatever you want used to edit and you zoom in as much as you can and I'm gonna make it very smooth I'm going to take that color and make it all this color so now it's just a nice white block now you can exit and save for this one. I'm going to do this for all of them, or just for a few of them. Take the color of the orange you want, and take that color, and now I'm going to change it all. Save. And let's do it for one more. Let's do it for the purple. And just color right over it. And that's how you edit the textures. You have to find the right file, wherever it is. They're named a little bit differently. These are for the blocks. These are for the items. So there you go. Now what you do is you open up your Minecraft thing by going to run again. And present app data. Go to Minecraft. I just created a shortcut to my files right here on my desktop so it's nice and easy for me to edit stuff. Now you go to texture pack and you put this in here. Now you can edit cool things like this. This is the name of the pack. I'm going to change it to 
my customized one. There you go. And this is just the font. Here is the picture that's with it. So I'm going to just erase it all for the fun of it. And I'm going to put a big letter A, or big letter, yeah, just a big letter A. Right there. That shall work. So now I can crop it if I want to, so it's a little better. There we go. Now save. Now that it's in the folder, I can just open up Minecraft. And you go to options. And you go to texture packs, which is right here. And as you can see, texture, my customized pack, the big letter A. Done, done. Go to single player. Go to any world you want. Here, I'm just going to create a new world. Super flat. Taking a while to build terrain. There we go. So now, my magenta wool, my normal wool, and my orange wool are all very smooth looking. And I like this personally. It's better for architecture. You can have things specifically colored. You can also put nice effects on it if you use something like paint.net or even if you use like Adobe Photoshop or for me I use Coral Paint Shop. If you use any of those you can make a lot more detailed, put transparencies on there, cool things like that, cool effects to make it look better. And as you can see of course I have all the new blocks and their textures on here none of those are blank so there you go that's how you make your own texture pack on minecraft 1.5.1 or just minecraft 1.5 since the change and if you have any questions just comment on the video i'll make I'll either answer your question or I'll may, maybe even make a video on how to do something if you guys still have questions about this it's pretty simple and since that since now that the textures are all moved into their own individual files I think it enables a little more ability to change the textures to what you want so they're not all right next to each other you don't have to worry about overlapping or anything like that you can just make changes to the whole thing not have to worry about the edges so it's, it's kinda nice and of course it's yeah, it's a lot more complicated to go through and find the files. But still, that's how you make the texture pack. Thanks for watching. Make sure to comment, subscribe, and watch future videos.